Let's see if we're good now. Let's see if this one's working. Is that Finn or Rocky? Rocky? Um, I think it's so cute. I think it's Rocky. We're not sure what happened. Are we good now? Are we unfroze? <laughs> Are we good? He still got the other one in his mouth. <laughs> it says we're good. Maybe we just don't have service over there. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't us. Hi, Kenai. 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 Oh, here comes June. We're not sure what happened. I think we're good, though. Second try, yay. I know. I was like, we gotta do it again. Because our other viewers that are on during the day don't really get to see us. Whoa. Hello. Perfect. Good. Sorry guys, not sure what happened. Thank you. I'm doing good. I feel like I just have a head cold. Feeling a lot better with the babes. She's doing good. We have our 20 week ultrasound, 3D ultrasound next week. Can you believe that? We're halfway over. We're halfway done. Hey, in four months. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess like four and a half, five months. I don't know. Just getting started. We already have like uh, some baby clothes. Oh, yeah, I went on a shopping spree with that one. Uh, one of those Christmas presents that came in today was for the baby. Oh. Yeah, one's for the baby. And then we got a crib. Yeah, got, a uh, bassinet. Seat, a bassinet. We a stroller. Got, oh, my gosh. We already got our daughter puppies. Look. <laughs> you know, hey, but if anybody, if anybody's an OG... What did Colin say he was getting if it was a girl? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Well, when she can start talking, maybe. Oh, whatever. When she can start talking, maybe. It is cold out here. It is freezing. Yeah, it's cold. I've got my heater on and gloves. Yeah. We have a few names that we've discussed, but nothing we're set on. I feel like we have to see her before June. we pick a name. You'd be nice. How much does June weigh, babe? Pounds? Yeah, I would say he's about 80 to 85 pounds. We need to break out the scale and weigh him. Yeah. What, he's just got, too big to fit on it now. He's got his nine month weigh in that comes in. I mean, the scale goes up to 500 pounds, but he, it's hard to get him to sit on. Yeah, because it's like 12 inches and 12 inches long. Kenai, he's always like that. Whenever he's excited, he's just, that's how he is. The family's supposed to buy baby stuff, not you. I know I can't help myself. I'm to buy baby stuff? No, me. I'm not supposed to. Well, that's why. <laughs> I'm kind of picky. Of no, I'm picky. Especially with clothes. Jim. Hello, hey. Jaco. No. Germany. Jim. Hold on, stay there. Jim. Hey. Toy. Pay attention to the toy. Hi, Jennifer. Good boy. June just has no idea what's going on. <laughs> Fluffy focuses on the toy. That's why he beats June to the toy every time. Whoa! <laughs> Do you guys hear his bark? Here he comes. Hi, buddy. He has such a deep bark. What time is it? It's like 2? Uh, I think it's yeah. one forty-five, two. Yeah, somewhere like that. Something like that. Hi, June. Did you hear that? I didn't realize that one had a squeaker. Father and son. Where's the mama?
almost 10 at night in the Netherlands. That's crazy. <laughs> wow. 10 p.m. Yeah. Well, we're glad that you can catch us live. So they probably normally don't catch us live. I know. We go at like six to seven. Yes. He's a good girl. Huh? Chad, I have COVID. <laughs> it's me. I don't think they're sick. The dogs don't seem sick. Has anybody else's dogs? I haven't really seen anybody else's dogs get COVID. I feel like I have a head cold. That's it. Like a sinus head cold. 2.30 at night in India. 2.52 in Texas. Dang. Netherlands, Texas, India. Another puppy? No way. No way. We got a baby on the way. Four, four Rotties and a, a baby human is enough. <laughs> Four PM in New York, eight fifty eight fifty two in the UK. That's so crazy. Thank you, Jacob. It's a lot better now that I'm past first trimester, Marcus. Thank you for asking. That was June that barked. <laughs> Yay, we're so happy that you guys can catch us live. We'll try to do this more often where we go in the day and the night. <laughs> Colin counts as a teenager. I guess I have a teenager with four dogs. <laughs> 10, 11, 12 chickens. Look how big three goats is. and a baby human. <laughs> and then two other uh, roommates. <laughs> you know, something that I wanted to mention because a lot of people have been commenting saying that June looks like he needs to eat. Um, keep in mind that these dogs will eat anything you put in front of them so just because they appear to be hungry doesn't mean they're hungry they're very well fed but if you overgrow them too fast that's when you get a lot of health issues later in life like if you look at fluffy he's very very healthy now he was a little chunker as a puppy he would eat everything but he had some food aggression and so he would always go over and steal keen eyes food and so he would always eat like one and a half portions of food um, June is very good with not taking the other dog's food, and he's actually doing pretty well on waiting. Um, they all kind of, they're pushing the limits. They try and get like a little bit closer every time we feed them, instead of like going to the outside of the room. But June is a great weight for his age, a great weight. Um, he's very healthy, he's very energetic, um, no health issues so far, like at all. He's very, he's, he sleeps less than I think any puppy that we've ever had either. Which might be a good or a bad thing. I haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> I'm hoping that with him being a crazy puppy, he'll be a good adult dog. Because Fluffy was a great puppy and now he's kind of a... Uh-oh, he heard me. He just needs a drink. He was coming, he was staring at me when I was saying that. Fluffy was the best puppy ever and now he's a punk. But anyway, who? I what? Just wanted to mention that Fluffy. <laughs> I remember when I did come here, he was pretty food aggressive. Yeah, and now he doesn't really care. No, he's, he's good. Okay. He's just laying there. <laughs> he's so funny. Yes, Roddy's. They will eat all day. That's why we do not free feed. But also June, he keeps going through growth like spurts and then not in spurts, and so we're just keeping his food the same, and so that he can just grow. June is also obsessed with socks lately. He will find them in the very bottom of my laundry bin. I don't know how, but socks are his thing. Yes, they grow up. They bulk as they get older, yes. June, what are you doing? What are you doing? Come here. Kenai. Good boy. Good boy. Come here. Where's the other one at? Oh, he has it. I got June over there. Got Fluffy right here. He's Kenai. so funny. <laughs> what are you doing hanging out alone, man?
No frost or snow yet. It's pretty cold out here. We get frost in the morning. Do we? Well, I guess yeah, our cars, huh? Yeah. And Colin said it was supposed to snow yesterday. I don't know. I've been down and out all week. He likes socks in general. I have no idea. Like father, like son. <laughs> yeah, no, because his grandfather, Junior, used to do the same thing, right? Wow. Socks? Oh, yeah. He wouldn't chew on them. He would just carry them? <laughs> yeah, he wouldn't chew on them or anything. He would just carry them in his mouth. June! Hey, June! We're going. Oh, go over there to get June! I don't know why he's in the yard. We're in Utah. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Good boy. Good boy. Finally getting some energy out. He and I. Come here! Come here! That's a good boy! Come I love here. the way he and I walks. He's Come my here. favorite. Come here! My little Come penguin. Here. Like, no for that. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Good boy. Wanna get them eggs? Yeah, we can go check in on the chickens. Show these guys the chickens. Yeah, he could be teething because he's in like a uh June? Yeah, he's in a horrible stage all over again. <laughs> it was like the puppy stage and then he did good for a while and now he's just being a menace again. Oh. You left your toy, dude. You can't do that. Come back and get it. I don't know what you mean. Why am I scaring people? I don't feel like I'm that scary. <laughs> Good boy. Don't get it. Get it. Come on. Get it. Yeah, it's nice that we have this back here so they can run. Get some energy out. Especially in winter, it's hard. Do you see him just challenge him? He does it all the time. He's always bugging everybody. Alright, let's check on the chickens. Let's I have them. COVID. But it feels just like a head cold. I haven't had a fever or anything like that. Breathing, no breathing issues. How about you, babe? I had that migraine the other day, mm -hmm. and body aches, but that's it. I don't get very sick. But. Yeah, I think just because I'm pregnant, it's just making it a lot harder for my body to recover. I'm gonna say hi. Hi. We got eggs left and right. There's eggs. You're right loud. And my little baby's so cute. I wonder if they're having them in there because those ones are always sitting in here. Um, one back there. We got some back here. We oh, we're good. We're. All, I think I'm on the um, mend because it's been about, I don't know, a week. A little over a week. Should we give these to the dogs? Mm -hmm. See, she's always sitting in here. You're always in here. She don't like that. Thank you. Yes, they literally fun. are. Somebody asked me a while ago if these eggs tasted any different than store-bought. 100%. Oh, yeah. They're so oh, much yeah. better. Chickens are one of the best things ever. And they're easy to take care oh, of. Yeah. Low maintenance. Oh, yeah. They if you don't have chickens, you need chickens. We provide, like, every day. Hey, I got some eggs for you guys. Oh, Sadie's like, what about me? What are you doing? We actually had him in the chicken coop for a few days. What are you guys doing? Look at June. He's still there playing. Yeah, he's just in his own little world. Hey, Kita, come here. June! Kita. June! Come here, sit. Kita, good girl. 
Fluffy's like, I've been sitting here the whole time, Dad. Okay, here you go. Oh, she broke it open. <laughs> oh, a lot of people have asked if eggshells are okay. Yeah, eggshells are fine. I mean, I wouldn't give them to like a tiny, tiny puppy because yeah. um, they can have sharper edges. But these guys, they pretty much they don't chew it all up and break it up. They like break the shell and then swallow it. So it still has kind of like that little film. So you watch Fluffy, he'll break it. And then he doesn't like break it into a thousand tiny pieces okay. and then try and swallow it. He kind of just swallows the whole thing. Yeah. And sometimes, was it Kenai or Kita wouldn't eat the eggshells? So it's not like they have to. Yeah, no. It's just a great source of calcium. See that? Snapper. He's correcting him. June's right here. Here, June. You want one? Soft, bro. You gotta be soft. No, softer. Yeah, sure. I like that. He ate all of his already. June is very excited yeah, about so, food. So they don't, it's not like they just take it and like swallow half of it to where it's really sharp on them. They kind of just break it up a little bit into smaller pieces and then swallow the whole thing. Well, Fluffy, you already have one. But yeah, great in calcium. So the eggs themselves, think about it this way. Like everything inside of that little egg can make a whole chicken, like a live living animal. So it's gotta be good for the animals. I think so. I mean, I used to eat raw eggs and I never got sick. The dogs have never gotten sick. Isn't that an old people eggs. thing? <laughs> I don't know. I'm not old people. Uh, I don't think I... Well, I guess I've eaten like, like raw cookie dough. <laughs> yeah. See, I mean, and like, I don't get sick. So maybe something's working for me. I don't know. But yeah, these guys eat raw eggs. Our dogs actually don't get that sick that much. Like sometimes they have gas, but... Uh, but not that bad. They don't get like sick. Kenai just they like if he much. gets an upset stomach and stuff. But yeah, no, I've only uh uh at all. But um yeah, thank you. Um, I have lost my smell and taste the last two days. <laughs> yeah, well, that's interesting. Look who she's dating. <laughs> Whatever. You're really good to me. Hey, you need to lock this. Yes, they eat shell. They don't have to, but they do. 1 p.m. in Vancouver, Columbia. That's cool. Thank you. Super sweet of you. Well, we were home today, so we wanted to say hi. I don't know if I dare walk over there. That's when we lost him last time. Well, for those of you guys, it was nice knowing you. <laughs> Hopefully we don't lose ya. If it starts glitching, let me know. Oh, I love them so much. You know, you got hay all over you. I love them. Look how cute. Rocky! Hi! Hello! They're so cute. They're really funny. I don't know which one your favorite fur baby is, but there's Kenai. June's off in his own little world over there. Here's Mama Kita. Oh, that's June. See? June's right there. Fluffy, he's over there. <laughs> I don't think my iron is in down. Well, I guess we'll check at the doctor next week. Hello, Brad. What's up, Fluffy? I literally just got him mixed up. Is that a for me, bro? Yes, there's Kenai. Excited about the goats. We're not sure how we got it. Do you know, babe, how, how we got COVID? It's easy. Honestly, I feel like I have a cold. It doesn't feel, no body aches, no fever, nothing. I feel like I have a head cold. I feel like I have a sinus infection. Colin's had a little bit of body aches, but. I did have that runny nose that one night in the middle of the night. And last night, last night I woke up, was last night? I woke up like coughing really, really bad. Oh yeah, you did. Oh my gosh. I thought I was gonna die for like two minutes. <laughs> Just like two minutes though. 
Yeah. Um, well, yeah. My my symptoms haven't been all at once. Where yours, like where your body's already doing something else. Yeah. Kind of hit you all stronger. Yeah. But mine, I've had like like one day I had aches. One day I had a bad migraine for like that whole night. Remember, we went to bed mm-hmm. at like seven, and then runny nose one night and cough the other night. Yeah, mine has hit me all at once. I think it's just because like I'm creating a baby, <laughs> so all my energy is going to the babe. Hi. Hi. June got Fluffy's toy. Yeah, you can get it from anywhere. What's up, Sadie? She's like, I want my food. We need to go see like C and Diesel. That's one thing we need to do soon. For her birthday? Like they broke that. Look at they broke that. You need to fix that. I think we should uh I think we should leave the goats to babysit Kenai one weekend because I don't think he would leave like this little area. <laughs> I don't think he would either. I don't think he'd leave the house at all. Kenai is very vocal. Huh. What do you think, Kenai? Kenai's the most talkative out of all. What do you think? Well, what do you guys think? You done getting some exercise? Yeah, I'm freezing. Alright. I just don't think they're used to each other. They've never really been around each other, so I don't think they like they're just curious. Kenai did back in the day when he's a little guy. But he hasn't seen him for probably four and a half, five years. Look at that tail wagon though, huh? You can definitely see him uh, limping a little bit, though. Yeah. We still got him on pain meds. Um, if anybody wants to see the most recent update on Kenai, um, it was in our video, How to Potty Train Your Rottweiler. That was the video, right? How to Potty Train? Yeah. How to Potty Train Your Rottweiler. Oh, there's radar puddles. Hey. <laughs> Say hi to Shadow. Hi, Shadow. <laughs> Oh, man, you were funny, you know that? It is cold out here. I think it's supposed to snow. You can't see the mountains, but our sunsets right now are beautiful and our sunrises. There's nothing like a Utah sunset and sunrise. Hey, it's almost time for a giveaway on Instagram too. So if you're not following us on Instagram, follow us on Instagram. Has anybody else put up their tree? Because I did. <laughs> I put mine up November 1st. Go show them. I should. Well, you just mentioned Instagram, so that's why, yeah, that's why it reminded me. I still need to post your picture with Kita. That one was funny. She's like laying on your Kita does not like pictures. Let's go. Come on, Mom. Yeah, we're in northern Utah. Huh? We love you. Hope the babies are doing well. Oh yeah, we didn't even get a look at them all. Brett, you totally should. Our candy corn, chompy corn. We gotta save that for next year. It can go in the Halloween bin. What happened to their goalie pop? The microphone. Colin needs the microphone. That one's already so dirty. We'll find it later. We got some jerky steak for them. Pumpkin honey. Thank you, Joseph. The baby's doing good. We have our 20 week appointment next week. We're halfway done. Hi, huh, babe. We're halfway getting started. <laughs> halfway done with the pregnancy. Let's see if I can open this. My fingers are cold. Hey, don't July eat those. 4th. I haven't seen him up that early. <laughs> no. Turkey. Turkey jerky. God, he's so pretty. He's so cute. Oh, Fluff. June, no. Good boy. And last but not least, the prettiest mama. June's like, where's another one? Yeah, June, we'll give you another one later. Lick or treat. Lick or treat. 
Lick, it's like trick or treat, but <laughs> lick or trick. <laughs> well, yeah, we're a little late on that. Gosh, it feels like winter out here overnight. Come on. You gonna show them the Christmas tree real quick and then we'll end it? I'll let you. All right, do you want this? Yeah, just don't show me because I don't look very well. How do I flip this? I can't flip it. Hold on. Hold on. Lock has been opened. Okay, look guys, she set up Christmas in the house already. It like, I don't even know. I don't know if it's coming in here or not. I don't even know if it was a day after Thanksgiving. And then all of a sudden, like, these little bags started showing up. Day after Thanksgiving? Day, day after Halloween. Day after Halloween. No, normally, it's the day after Thanksgiving. <laughs> but, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Um, but, yeah, all these little bags start showing up. And then all of a sudden, Sam texts me. And she's like, I got a Christmas tree. And I'm super excited about the Christmas tree. She put up like her Merry Christmas thing here. She's got stockings for the, we need some light in here. Hold on, sorry guys. We got- Target, five bucks. <laughs> dog stockings, so Christmas tree. So if you have any ideas why to put in the stockings, let me know. We're Sam, not done yet. Sam's going all out with this business. She's got some little, what are these? Christmas gnomes? Yeah. We're not, not even supposed to be in yet. We're just getting started. Yeah. I'm gonna go show them our projects out front. Is that okay? Yeah. All right, guys. I know we said that we were gonna end it, but we're, I'm gonna show you guys the project that I have been working on. So check out what I did to my garage floor. I put in all new flooring and I also got some Christmas cabinets. Christmas comes early here for us. So we got a uh, Christmas tree put up. We got my Christmas presents. Now the reason why I wanted to have this done was because, uh, well, I just don't think I'm going to do it when, uh, I don't think it's going to get done when the baby comes, honestly. I just don't. So we've got that going on. Uh, we still got our little decorations out front here. Hi. Got our decorations out front. I just built this porch. Um, like I think it was about a month or two ago. So I've got... Sam's got all of her pumpkins out here and her decorations. And then we just got our privacy fence put in. Sam has a wreath that's gonna go there and we've gotta redo this window trim because it's all falling apart. Thank you. I don't want COVID, so you can give it to her. <laughs> okay, thank you. So yeah, those are our projects that we have going on outside in the front of the house got the garage getting all nice and nice and finished up before the baby comes and then i'll show you guys some baby stuff that we got somebody actually just brought some like baby heart monitor or something just dropped it off out front of the house they said they didn't want covid so they weren't going to come up to the house but we got this little bassinet that's going to be going on the bedside table for Sam and little Sam, little baby Sam. And then we've got this gray crib. What do you guys think of uh what do you guys think of the little one coming in? What do you think, June? You're gonna have some little baby competition. How does that make you feel? You're all scratching up this. I gotta repaint this too. It's getting cold out though, so uh, it's going to be 
perfect time to be doing projects inside the house. You can see we've got our heaters out. Look. If you guys haven't seen that video of Fluffy and that turtle, <laughs> I think it's on Instagram. That is so funny. Fluffy thinks it's like a real turtle and he's trying to catch it out of the water. But anyway, um, that kind of wraps it up for today's live. Thanks for joining us on some playtime. We're going to get these guys calmed down and probably, uh, probably a nap now. Thanks for tuning in with us. We appreciate you guys. Uh, thanks for checking in on us. We're doing well. Sam is feeling a little more under the weather than I am. Again, thank you guys for all checking in on us. Uh, be sure to check out our Instagram, our Facebook. Be sure to watch all of our YouTube videos for the holiday seasons with your family because we've got plenty of content for you guys. And don't forget to like this video. We'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace out.